Hi everyone, this is Caroline. Today I'm going to show you how to make four 5x7 card fronts using your beautiful pattern paper stash. I know I have tons of it. I just can't resist buying it. But I am more likely to use it if I've already cut it up into card fronts where I can just simply attach it to a, a card base with something that I've already stamped or colored and I'm just that much more likely to use it and get that card in the mail. So uh, I know you probably can identify with some of the patterns I'm showing you here. This is a card that I'm ready to put in the mail. It's a Colorado Craft Company stamp that I colored with uh, Copic markers and pencil. But I'm using this beautiful Cardabella card stock that I had ready and was able to attach it, stamp the inside, and get it in the mail the same day. Pretty proud of that. So you'll be so surprised how easy this is. Okay, so all you need is a paper trimmer. And you can use the guillotine style. I find this sliding type of uh, paper trimmer is easier just because you can control and see exactly where you're stopping the paper. That one's for later. Okay, so what I've done is taken a little piece of washi tape and marked at the five and seven inch line right on the finger guard, but we'll be using that five inch spot right, right at the top. So simply, yeah, pull it all out and look for your five inch spot on that ruler at the top. And then just slide down your, uh, your blade. And I got this idea from an Anna Griffin tutorial. And before this, I was, I just, it didn't dawn on me how to do this. I was just wasting paper as I needed. I would just cut out that front, you know, measuring it out. And that piece of paper would just sit until I needed it the next time. I didn't do it like this, which uh, has solved a lot of the, the paper scrap problem for me. So this is all that's left. It's a two by two square from the middle. And that won't go to waste either, I guarantee. But I'll just add this to my stash. Hope you enjoyed this. Please like and subscribe. I'd appreciate it. And I will catch you next time. Bye.